Hello, I'd like to do a uh, quick demonstration video on Samsung's WW9000 washing machine with Eco Bubble. Um, I've only had it for about three weeks and it's an absolutely fantastic washing machine. Um, it absolutely does everything for you. Um, there's an, uh, a wash cycle on there called um, Auto Optimal uh, Wash and it absolutely put everything in. Um, you don't have to do anything, it absolutely uh, weighs the clothes itself, uh, works out um, how soiled the clothes are uh, and then automatically d uh, dispenses um, the um, washing liquid and fab fabric softener itself um, and works out uh, the wash cycle, uh, everything, does basically everything for itself absolutely fantastic machine um, and I've also got um, Samsung's uh, new dishwasher uh, with waterfall um, and it's a uh, I'll give you a um, quick demonstration yeah absolutely open the machine um, and it's all it's uh, illuminated um, inside um, and uh, you the uh, switch it on uh, absolutely sings to you, <laughs> sings to you. Um, it's all uh, lit up. Uh, it's an absolutely beautiful machine. Um, absolutely gets everything sparkling clean, um, and uh, you can actually um, choose um, just to load one half uh, of the dishwasher um, um, independently. So you can just have the left side um, loaded, and it will only wash. Um, just the left half of the dishwasher um, or you can just have the right side loaded um, and it will only wash just the right side of the dishwasher so it's extremely uh, economical um, but um, it was um, the washing machine um, that I was actually going to um, be doing the uh, demonstration on um, today um, so um, I'll start, uh, the main thing that I wanted to show you um, was this um, system check diagnostic um, that Samsung have actually put onto uh, the system. Um, and you, you, you access this by um, just basically going into the settings menu. Um, and if you scroll down, um, you'll actually see it where it actually says um, um, self-check. Um, and you just basically press uh, the self-check. Um, and um, you just press uh, the start um, button um, and there you hear it lock uh, the door um, and um, there's um, a list of features that it will um, that it will check uh, mainly uh, the door lock uh, the water supply uh, the auto dispense I'll explain that in a minute um, the pump um, the Wi-Fi signal um and uh the door lock um i'll explain more about the wi-fi signal i know you're probably thinking uh a washing machine that needs wi-fi signal um but i'll i'll explain that to you uh explain more about that to you in a minute um and um as it works its way down um the list uh, you'll see um that it will either pass everything off or it will fail it um, and actually tell you um, uh, what you'll need to do if it actually fails anything off um, but one thing you'll actually need to be aware um, is that um, the height of your, your waste pipe because I actually plumbed in the washing machine and the dishwasher myself and I had to put in a couple of extra wall sockets in myself. Um, one thing you need to be aware with both these machines, right, um, they need to be on independent wall sockets. You can, they can't be on double wall sockets. They have to be on independent. So each machine, uh, each machine has to have its own single socket. Uh, it can't be on a double socket. So it can't share a wall socket itself. Um, um, it has to have its own independent single wall socket um, so um, I had to put in uh, a couple of wall sockets um, and then um, obviously pumped them in but your waste pipe um, has to be uh, at a certain um, uh, handle basically the, the, the way your waste comes down from the sink 
um, if you keep your waste pipe at that at that height, um, but obviously just put a slight uh, slant on it towards uh, your waste pipe um, to towards um, your air sink because obviously um, uh, water runs downhill. So if you put a slight, keep it at the same height as your um, as your uh, waste under your sink, uh, and then just put a slight um, downward slope on it so your water runs down. Um, towards you um, under your sink um, and then obviously put your um, your trap for uh, each machine on it um, you, sh you should be okay um, but if it's too high or too low your machine won't pump out your water um, but obviously the machine will then tell you that there's a problem uh, with the uh, with your waste pipe but as you can see if you look here um, you can see that it's um, it's passed everything off um, and it's um, basically saying that um, uh, the installation's okay um, and it hasn't um, detected any problems uh, with the um, with the uh, installation right um, the next thing that I was um, I was going to show you right um, is um, basically uh, the uh, Wi-Fi side of it um, with this machine you can actually control uh, the machine uh, from your mobile phone um, there's an application that you need to actually download um, called Samsung Smart Home um, and um, it allows you to actually control uh, the washing machine um, by your phone so say like if you've um, gone out shopping um, you can put the, your washing in, in the machine um, and then um, you know, I don't know, so like, um, you know, you're on your way back home and you might think, oh, I'll, I'll, you know, I'll put the washing on now. So by the time I get home, it'd just be finished. So I can take it out and put it in the dryer or whatever, whatever else you actually uh, need to actually do. Right. Um, so like um, this is um, this uh absolutely fantastic feature uh, of this machine um, so you can actually control it by your phone so here is my um, Samsung S7 um, so what you have to do first um, which is uh, a bit annoying um, uh, and I'm hoping Samsung will actually sort this out um, on a future um, software update for the machine but what you have to do each time you have to do this you have to do this each time you switch the machine on you can actually do it by going into uh, the um, settings menu and then if you actually scroll down um, um, you'll actually see smart control and then what you have to do is then swipe that across to on um, but there is a quicker way of doing it um, if you just from the main menu uh, I'll do it again for the main menu if you just swipe down um, and um, you, you'll see here uh, it says uh, child lock drum light uh, auto detergent auto fabric softener um, the network and then if you just tap smart control right and then um, what you um, then allows you to actually control the machine from your uh, mobile phone um, and then what you have to do as it says you have to um, get um, the app is um, available for iOS as well so it's available for the iPhone it's only um, iPhones and uh, Android at the moment um, I don't think it's available um, for uh, the um, uh, Microsoft phones um, at the moment um, so you have to um, just um, as you can see is the uh, smart homes application so you just tap the smartphones application right um, and there you can see it says washer and you can see there it says that the machines ready right um, and then here's all the um, the wash programs that are available so there's diff different um, 
programs like you've got uh, for Demum, uh, Dark Garments, uh, Super Speed, um, Eco Wash, etc. Um, but um, the one that I'm going to basically show you today um, is the Auto uh, Wash Cycle. So if I just uh, tap the uh, auto wash cycle, and then if you uh, if you keep an eye on the uh, display on the machine, right? If I just tap start there, and you can see the machine um, has started the wash cycle, and then if you keep an eye eye on the machine. Uh, you can actually see there uh, that the machine's actually um, detecting the weight and the level of soiling. And then there you can actually see that it's actually completed now. Um, and you can actually see. And the, the other thing that I like about the actual machine as well um, is that it's actually got a drum light. So you can actually see into the drum. But to actually um, activate the drum light, again, you just actually um, just tap. Um, you just swipe down from the... The uh, top, and then if you just tap the drum lights, and there you can actually see um, the drum light switched on, so you can actually see into the drum. Um, and then if you actually look on the display, you can actually see um, I was a bit too uh, slow there. You could actually, you would have actually seen that it actually came up on the display, um, that it was automatically uh, dispensing uh, the detergent. Uh, into the uh, into the machine, so uh, it basically automatically dispenses the uh, uh, the detergent, um, and then um, on the uh, final uh, rinse cycle, um, it will automatically uh, dispense uh, the fabric softener um, as well. Um, so it basically um, does everything uh, for itself, um, and um, as it says, when it spins, it is so quiet, uh, it is unbelievable, and the clothes uh, come out so clean, um, it is unbelievable. Um, uh, the machine, it's, it is very expensive. Um, it cost me um, just over £1,300, because I'm in the UK. Um, so it is a very, very expensive machine, but it is... An investment because um, Samsung says the machine um, is actually guaranteed uh, for 10 years um, but it should actually last you um, in excess of 20 years um, so it is a long-term investment um, and the, the quality of the machine uh, the build quality absolutely superb absolutely fantastic machine and well worth every every penny basically um so that's a quick demonstration of the samsung ww9000 machine with eco bubble um i will do another um video uh, in depth with um demonstrating a lot more of the other uh, washing cycles so i hope you like this video and i hope you uh, found it uh, useful and interesting um so thanks for watching 
um, and hope you enjoyed um, it. Peace out.